Okay. I'm here. Hey! I made it! <laughs> Is everything all right? Yeah. You can come up. Um, you do know you have the walkie-talkie, right? You can come up. Just go ahead. Mm -hmm. I need to find something in, in my backpack. I bet you want to nap some more. I know you all too well. <laughs> oh, maldición. Can't hide anything from you. Very well. You can catch up, guess. The path leads through that canyon. Mm-hmm. I know. Oh, uh, have you tied down the boat? Si. Jake, um... <laughs> I know this might sound stupid under the circumstances, um, but I am glad we came back here. Yeah, I feel you. The yeah, place is beautiful. Still? Still, we can't forget what we came here for in the first place, I know. But, as soon as we're settled in, I am off to the Jabahuaca village. And what if they will not speak to us? Come on, let's not get ahead of ourselves. You're a phenomenal interpreter. If anyone can communicate with them, it's you. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Good thing I have an anthropologist at hand, Dr. Higgins. Okay, I found the tent. Is everything all right? The camp looks impressive. They put up a tent for us. Looks like everything's ready. Soul Trail always delivers. At first glance, it looks like we have everything we might need. Perfecto. Well, that's everything. We're officially settled in. You know what that means, don't you? I remember the agreement, but maybe you should... Maybe we should reconsider this. I'm not sure it's the best idea for you to visit them alone. Romantic canned beans. Everything the porters left. Why? Is anything missing? I'm not sure yet. Uh, huh, but it feels that way.
Looks like everything's ready. Mia, can you bring me a lighter? Um, remember when I mentioned we seemed to be lacking some equipment? <sighs> Don't tell me. Yeah, we have no fire. <sighs> Not a single lighter, nor a box of matches. Uh, we, we ordered both. Did you check everywhere? I did. You need to do it the old-fashioned way. Well, not the best start of the expedition. need to find something dry. Oh, Mia! The fire is burning. Coming. Give me a minute. How do you do it? Hmm? What? You seem so calm. I am calm. I don't know how to explain it, but strangely, it feels safer here than there. Oh, I don't know. Jaguars, venomous spiders, and snakes. Let's not forget the scorpions. A <laughs> mere ant's bite hurts like hell. I am well aware of that. But still. We have a chance to achieve something, make a difference. At home, all we could have done was be helpless and wait. I prefer the wilderness. I'll miss you, and I'll be worried. But I'll do some work in the meantime. <laughs> when we meet, I should be able to catch a fish and start a fire with a single spear strike. You say you'll be afraid. And yet you are in high spirits. That's what I like about you. Nonetheless, I'm a bit worried about you meeting the Yabawaka. Everything will be fine. I need to go alone. We already agreed that's the only way. Besides, they don't seem to like you. They don't seem to like outsiders. They shot arrows at a military chopper. Hard to blame them. Since you published your book, they've been under siege by the media, scientists, doctors. The World Health Alliance established a medical camp and probably performed research, violating the tribe's taboos. But I will convince them. I have to. 